What is up guys and welcome back to the vlog. I am here now. I just woke up and at a friend's house and ended up crashing here last night. I'm about to go meet with my social workers again today. Um, and I hope I'm going to be able to take back some boots. Which I totally forgot to bring with me so I'm going to see if I can get a receipt for them and then just take them back on Saturday. Um, and then after that, I think I'm good. I also, the other day at work, I burnt my arm really bad. And <coughs> it's getting better, but today it's really sore, so, you know, what are you going to do? But after this, I'm going to, um, when I meet with my social workers, I think I'm just going to hang out in town. I'm not sure what I really want to do yet. I might go to Tim Hortons and get a coffee or something, and then I'm going to head back to the 70 Mile House and chill out for, just for the day. I think today's Wednesday that I'm recording right now, um, so I have today off and tomorrow off, and then I work Friday, Saturday, and then Sunday is Christmas, which I will be posting a vlog for you all on a Christmas one. I'm thinking probably Wednesday or Thursday of next week, only because... I'm going to record Christmas, and then I'm going to do a couple days after Christmas of recording. Excuse me. As well as that I'm going to be working um, Christmas Eve, Boxing Day. Oh, excuse me. And the day after Boxing Day I work, so. Um, yeah, it's just a few days in a row there, but um, other than that, I think I, it's all going to be good from now on. I know my last vlog was pretty long, I don't know how long this one's going to be, I might get a couple days worth of footage for you guys and smash it all up into one vlog here, but we'll see what goes on and I'll see what I can post for you guys, so I hope you enjoyed today's vlog, I hope you enjoyed last vlog, and if you could only do me a huge favor right now, go and hit that like button, I would really appreciate it, also subscribe to my channel, and share this video on any social media account you want, get everyone watching my vlogs because the more people that watch it, it makes me feel good. I know you guys like and enjoy watching my videos. I see a lot of you guys have been watching them lately. My views have been gone way up lately, so I'm super thankful for that. So please go sh tell everyone to watch this. Like go share it on your Facebooks and your Snapchats, your Instagrams, your Twitters, your whatever you use. Go and share this video for me, please, and like my video so I know you guys are watching. So I'm in my meeting right now. I'm just waiting for both social workers to come in here. And then after that, I have to walk over to Donut to meet Wendy. I'm probably going to go grab a coffee afterwards because I am fucking tired. This burn on my arm is killing me right now. Like, I don't know what I did last night. Like, I put hot water on it last night when I was having a bath to see if it was sensitive. And man, was it sensitive to the hot water. So this jacket is just killing me wearing this jacket over this burn. But it's so cold outside that I just can't take my jacket off when I'm outside. And now I have to walk all the way to Donix after this. And this jacket's going to be brutal. I think I might have to take it off here just because the feeling of it rubbing up against me is just brutal. So I just finished up at the uh, social worker's place. I ran over to Donix. Wendy was not there, so I ran all the way over to the dollar store. And I found her in there. I ended up buying her some gifts at the dollar store as well. Then we went to... Um, Save on food and grabbed a couple things there. And now I'm just sitting outside the counselor's office. She's in there meeting with someone right now. I just talked to someone quickly and wrote them a letter. And now I am just waiting in the truck. Hopefully, Wendy shouldn't be too long. And then I can go from here. I also ended up getting a few, uh, two presents from my social worker. And I really like them. I, I want to thank her over here. I won't give her name out because she doesn't want her name out on the internet just because of security reasons, but that's okay. But I want to thank her so much if she's watching this. And she ended up getting me a really nice Rocky camo hat and a pair of heat max gloves, which is really awesome. So I want to thank her as well. Um, so right now I think I'm just going to sit here. I have, like, no, I don't really, I have, I would go down and get a coffee at Tim Hortons, but you know. That's a long walk from here, and I just don't feel like walking there and then walking all the way back. So I'm just going to chill out here. Probably have to wait here for about half an hour, and then I'm going to see if she'll drive me over to Tim Hortons, and I'm going to grab a quick coffee. 
and probably like a donut or a breakfast sandwich or something. Um, and then I'm gonna go from there. I'm probably gonna go back over to Mark's house. I'm gonna grab a few things from there. And then once we leave there, I'll probably just go right back to the house. So it's 70 mile there, and I'm just gonna chill out there. I left the heaters on out there last. The last time I was there, I did not leave my heaters on, which was stupid of me. And I didn't. I I didn't really like that idea. It was really stupid. Um, it turned out that it was freezing cold in there so I left my heaters on this time and hopefully when I get there it will be super warm upstairs so I don't have to worry about that so last night we ended up um, camelizing all of our phones when we were at Mark's house we did his phone, Wendy's phone, Bree's phone and we did my phone and this is what my phone looks like now it's camo on the back here and then we also did a bit of the front here as well um, it looks awesome it's sadly not my uh, um, waterproof case but I don't wear my waterproof case all the time anymore on my phone I like to have it like just in a normal plastic case for when I'm like in town and stuff because what's the point in wearing a waterproof case if you just sit in a vehicle all day or whatever like I I bring it with me just in case I decide to do something same with like my camera I have here I'll bring the water waterproof GoPro case for it just in case I end up do go into want to do something I have a case so I can bring it in the water for you guys. Sadly, when I go in the water with the GoPro case on this camera, you cannot hear me at all. Like, it's there's no sound quality at all. The camera it is now, the sound quality, I know my last video was really bad. I'm going to try and get it better in this video. Um, I hope you guys do enjoy the better quality of the video. I know there's a little time thing in the bottom of the corner of the camera when I post my videos. I don't know how to get rid of that quite yet. I'm still learning how to do video editing with the software I have. I can't afford to do many other softwares that a lot of the bigger vloggers do. Like you guys may know uh, Lance Stewart. He's a very good vlogger. Uh, so is Cody Yoint. He's a very good vlogger. I watch both of their vlogs every single day. Um, they're the ones that inspired me to start vlogging. Uh, I hope you guys should go check them out on YouTube. Lance Stewart and Cody Yoink, they do vlogs every single day. Um, usually between 1 and 2 their vlogs are up every single day. Uh, go check them out, but make sure you guys still come back to me and watch my vlogs every, every single time I post them. Like I always tell you guys, if you want to know when I'm going to post a video, I always throw it up on my Twitter my Instagram, my Snapchat, and Facebook. I put them all on there, so you guys should know. But if you guys don't want to check those all the time, you can always turn on my post notifications on um, YouTube and subscribe to my channel, and you'll never miss a new video I post. In case you guys don't know how to turn on post notifications, I'm going to show you quickly right now. So you just go to your any on your YouTube app on any mobile device and you click this little bell icon right here and it'll come up with asking if you want to confirm that you want to turn on post notifications and you just hit confirm and it'll show to so like it's ringing and that means you have your post notifications on now because I'm signed in to my own account I don't turn my own post notifications on my own account so I just turned that on for um, one of the people I watch as well so um, I will have post notifications every time he posts a new video I will get notified right away so make sure you guys go and do that you I think you can also do it on any com Apple computer as well um, or the or the newest Windows computers I, if you get the YouTube apps you can go ahead and turn on your post notifications and it works so make sure you guys do that and try not to miss any of my vlogs I know some of them are not the best like some of them have really bad stuff I do or some of them are boring and I hope you guys still stick th stick to it and still watch my videos and still try and hit that like button and every time you guys hit a like button the next video I put up will just be more and more better content for you guys I know my vlogs are very vulgar I am starting to not swear as much um, because I know a lot of my younger viewers don't like that but I'll give it a shot and try not to swear to you guys as much from now on. So just give this video a thumbs up and I will start putting out better content for you guys. Once a week I'll post a video.
So I'm ending the vlog here for today. I don't know if I'm going to be posting another vlog t or adding some more footage for this vlog tomorrow. Only because I think I'm going to sit my fat ass down for one fucking day and just relax. Because I've had enough of fucking moving around. So this will probably be the end of the vlog. So if you guys do like this vlog, please smash my th that thumbs up button. Subscribe to my channel. And like I always say, turn on the post notifications so you never miss a new video. And I will see you next time. If you guys want more videos than just once a week, I can also um, do more videos. I can't really vi vlog while I'm at work. It's one of the things I can't do when I work. Uh, Monday, Tuesdays, and Wednesdays, and sometimes not like this week I work Friday, Saturday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. So really, I've only had Wednesday and Thursday off this week, and then I work. I get Sunday off, which is which is Christmas, and then I work right again. So the days I don't work, I will for sure vlog for you guys and get some good footage. Um, if you guys want anything else, just comment below what you guys want to see, and I will for sure send you guys some videos out there. A lot of people in my family, including like Wendy and Bree and stuff like that, they don't prefer to be in my vlogs right now. They're, I guess you'd call it camera shy. Um, Wendy's always saying she, I always record when she doesn't, she's not wearing her makeup and she's not do, looking the, her best or any, whatever. But I think you guys would prefer to see us as a, our normal selves than have us go out of our way and try and make it so like we look our best and we perform our best. Like, yeah, I'll do different takes for my videos and try and make it look the best for you guys, but I will also not do things that I wouldn't normally do in my day. I will try and put some stuff in there. Like, if you guys have suggestions of what you want to see in my videos, just shoot me out a comment on there. Me tweet me, do whatever, message me on Facebook, on Instagram, whatever, like, and let me know what you guys want, and I will go forth and I will do the best of my ability for you guys.
just didn't know what to do. I just didn't know what to do. But when I become a star, we'll be living so large. I'll do anything for you. So baby, what you say? What you say? That you only meant well. Oh, well, of course, of course you I didn't. Did. What you say? Oh, what you say? What you say? Oh, what you say? Oh, what you say? Oh, well, of course it is. What is up guys, and right now I am going to cook some fucking food. So this is going to be cooking with Drunk Nolan, because I am fucking drunk. So, I think I'm going to make chicken sidekicks. So I'm going to set this up and I'll show you guys how I'm going to make it. So, to make chicken sidekicks, we're going to be making these. You are going to want a pot. And you're going to want to fill the pot up. So you want to fill the pot up with water at least halfway to three quarters of the way full. So that looks about good there. Then you're going to want to put the pot on the stove. And see it's on the stove. Then you're going to make sure you turn on the right element. And I turn it on all the way. And then add yourself some salt. So you want to add your salt into your water. Just the right amount. And now you're going to want to let it boil for till it well, till it boils and then you're going to want to add the, the side cooks or the side kicks sorry and cook them for about seven minutes i'm guessing that's what it says on the package so that's what i'm going to go with i'm also drinking twisted tea right now i'm loving it it is also new year's eve so you know And I got my new e-cig here. Just for you guys. Another good thing to know is clean your stoves. I'm at a friend's house right now, and his stove reeks. It smells like smoke in here right now. He did not clean his stove out, I guess. And there was smoke coming up here. I had to move my pot over to a different burner. And this one is smoking too? What the hell? We should... Okay, we switched it again. That one's smoking as well. So hopefully this back one here is not going to smoke. Maybe it's just the front ones, but man, does it reek in here now. So now the water is almost boiled. So we're going to take your sidekick packages, these things here, and you want to rip the top. There's already a little start of a rip for you, so it's super easy. Make sure you throw your garbage in the garbage can. And now that your water is boiling, just pour it in. And then you try and find yourself a spoon. Like a wooden spoon or well we'll start with a regular spoon and we'll move. Oh look at that, wooden spoons are right there. Now get yourself a wooden spoon. Not just for spanking. And then you want to turn it down, probably about halfway. And leave your spoon over top so it does not boil over. Then you take the rest of your garbage and you throw it out. Then you take a drag off your cigarette and a sip of your drink. Sometimes it's good to add your drink to the mix. Yes. No. Yes. No. What are you saying to me? No. Yes. 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 No. Yep. No. Yep. No. Yep. No. Yep. No. Yep.
Okay, so I totally forgot to show you guys this, but once it boils for seven minutes, you take some butter, you put it in the pot, you put a little glo big glob in there, about two tablespoons, put a lid on it, and let five minutes sit. So I think I'm going to wrap up this vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed this. A few days of footage all put into one for you guys. Um, well, Happy New Year's, Merry Christmas, because I haven't posted a vlog since those, both of those holidays. Um, I'm going to upload this vlog right now for you. I'm just editing right now. And oh my god, we are at 20 minutes. So this is going to be a 20 minute video. That's my longest video. So make sure you hit that like button and share this video and subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys soon.